just want to talk about a safer way to use flat top batteries in these Sofern Q8 flashlights. They have the Q8 Pro, the Q8 Plus, and the BLF version. Uh, the tubes are basically all the same with them. Um, they're made to work with a button top flat, uh, button top batteries on them to where, where the battery is, it'll run smoother on this ring inside of it. Um, and that allows for when you twist it on, it'll smoothly rotate in here and make contact. And they compensate, they have the spring set to where they're made to work with this length of a battery with a, uh, button top battery gets the right pressure on here to where they don't rattle around where they keep constant connection and if, if you use a flat top cell something like one of these it's a little more gap in between here so when you use these batteries like this that's shorter um, the spring will get it somewhat tight on here but not quite as tight as it needs to so if it rattles around a lot you get vibration not uh, constant connection not only is it short the uh, LED in and out but it can actually cause the battery to heat up a lot and you can burn up a cell and almost cause your flashlight to basically explode on you so you have to be super careful when using flat top cells in something like this so what a lot of people will do they'll add magnets to the top of them something like a little one like this or a round one which even better sitting on top of the cell to gain some more height out of it and smooth out how it runs on the channel. But when you use these batteries, these uh, magnets on top, they don't stay terribly well. Uh, some people try to sort of glue them on, that sort of thing, but they can shift inside of there when you're tightening it down and go back to that loose connection, shorten out or not working at all. So Sofren doesn't make it, but Convoy, makes an adapter. It's a four battery adapter that's made to fit inside of their flashlights. And their flashlight tubes have almost identical size. Um, just, they're just a hair bigger than these, but just barely. So what you can do is just basically replace your button tops, put all um, flat tops in here and use that adapter. And the adapter has, um, instead of using this metal, no telling what you're getting from uh, some of these coatings on these magnets, you're actually getting copper connection on it. So you're getting a little bit better transfer from piece to piece here. These are rounded edges. They're smoothed off. So when it's twisting inside of your light back and forth, it's not going to grind up and damage this conductive ring in here it's going to be smooth travel back and forth and actually smoother than some of these button top batteries are so you can put these shorter flat top cells in here get this lined up you make have to make sure it sits down solid on here it doesn't move around it touches everything good and then you mount this in here with flat top cells you're going to get a much better connection once I get this all the way tight, lights up, you can see it. I've got my light going. No flickering, no bumping in and out, and most importantly, no uh, complete cutting off and or flicking in and out and damaging your cells that are blowing up your battery, ruining things, or burning your house down. So these adapters, even though they're not made for Sofren and they don't actually say that you can use them, uh, if you're willing to try this at your own risk, um, I feel sh like it's a way safer option than using magnets inside of these shorter cells, flat tops. It allow you to use them. You know, inexpensive batteries like these have been harvested out of... Uh, uh, laptop battery packs um, but if you want to use a way more powerful cell um, some of these high-end uh, Sanyos and uh, Samsung cells and some others they put out a lot higher uh, 
amperage back and forth and will actually make your light a little bit brighter. And this will transfer that power much better than a magnet will and much safer, I feel, than you can with that. So I'll put the links to these below where you can buy them. They're pretty inexpensive. They can be from around a dollar to two dollars for them and uh, you can get free shipping. I'll, uh, I'll put a link to that for you and hopefully this helps somebody out. If you, if it does help you out, please like, and subscribe. Uh, I feel much safer using these, never had any trouble with them and uh, wouldn't go back to the magnets again. And like I said, this works with the sofa and Q models, the pro, the plus or the BLF version of it. So thanks for watching.